Hey there, my name is Melissa Price. I am from Charlotte, North Carolina, and this is Spelling Out Spirit. Hi, what is spirit? Um, I believe spirit is that little inner being inside of you, that little voice, that knowing. Um, when you go deep within, it's who you are. It's not tactile, you can't touch it, but it's just your, your inner essence. All right, so in a sentence or two, can you tell us what spirit means to you or what spirit is to you? Spirit to me is what's in the heart, what's in the soul. So if you feel it. So spirit, what is spirit to me? Spirit to me is whatever moves you. Whether it be woodworking or nature, hiking, whatever it is. Spirit is whatever moves you. Hopefully you have a great spirit. So, Miss Sophie, what does spirit mean to you? It, it means, um, really, it means, like, animals and, like, it means pretty much kindness, freedom. Kindness and freedom? Um, and all type of stuff, like love and nature and everything. What is your spirit all about? Um love and um freedom good girl bye guys hope you enjoyed this video Don't. so spirit is like a vessel to travel from where we are now to where we ought to be all of our passions were cemented in our hearts way ahead of us by god our creator um, to not follow the callings of our hearts is basically to deny ourselves a deeper connection with God and our spirit. Uh, I was looking up um, spirit in the dictionary and a couple of the common definitions are one, the non-physical part of a person that is at the seat of emotions and character, otherwise known as the soul. And the other one I found was the quality of courage energy, determination, and assertiveness. Now, can you imagine if we had more spirit number two, energy, determination, about our spirit number ones, our, uh, our souls, so to speak. Imagine how much more we would grow. Our souls were created in love, therefore we create in love. The soul's purpose is one of light, guidance, and connection. The calming hush in the ocean waves, the welcoming scent of a fully bloomed tree on a summer day, we're all part of it. That's good news, right? <laughs> the creations that swim in the sea and the creatures that fly in the sky, we're all part of them. Through our joys, our sorrows, successes, failures, new endeavors and traditions, we are all part of each other. This is quite a big walk. <laughs>